This is module three, lesson two homework, the front. Today's objective was to apply the distributive and commutative properties to relate multiplication facts five times n plus n to six times n and n times six where n is the size of the unit. Number one, each cube has a value of nine. So if I look at this, I know that one cube is nine. I have one, two, three, four, five groups of nine. As unit form, this is written as five nines. As a fact for my commutative property, I have five times nine equals nine times five. To find my total, I can count by fives nine times. I have my fingers out and I'm counting. Five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty, thirty-five, forty, forty-five. So my total is forty-five. Underneath I have added one more nine. Each cube still equals 9. I still have my original 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 cubes, and I've added 1 more, giving me a total of 6 nines. I started with my 5 nines, and I added one nine. I still have my total of 45 plus one more block of nine. 45 plus nine. I'm using my fingers and counting up. 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54. That gives me a total of 54. When I come to my facts, I have a total of 6 blocks, and each block equals 9. 6 times 9 is 54. Using the commutative property, I can also say 9 times 6 is 54. 